Apparently, they are taking lives. Welcome to my channel. It's your girl, baby girl, Tos, aka Tosin. Now, you guys are telling the name Tosin Oluwa Tosin. I'm Nigerian, of course. And today, I'm going to be your lovely host. In honor of our independence today, I decided to shoot a How Nigerian Are You game show with a couple of contestants, aka some of my friends. And we're going to see how Nigerian each and every one of us is. I decided to come up with this game. You can play with your friends and also make sure that before the video even gets started, you are giving this video a like. It helps me a lot to know that I'm doing something right. You're also sharing your friend as well because how are you going to keep this quality concept by yourself? So make sure you're sharing it with your friend. So how the game is going to go is that I'm going to be asking a bunch of multiple choice questions and I'm going to be getting their reaction to see whether they get the answer right or wrong. And we're going to be awarding points to each of us and see whether by the end of this video, how Nigerian we are. You guys can also join the game as well by answering the questions alongside with us. And another thing is, I'm going to be bringing back post notification shout outs. So if you guys want to be shouted out in my next video or the next episode of I Your Big Age, make sure to hashtag, hashtag BGT, hashtag Baby Girl Toast on your timeline so I can see you and you may be the lucky BGT member that gets a shout out in my next video. Before the video starts, all you secret admirers that are most subscribed, boy, are watching me. I need you to just take this moment to subscribe. Do you understand? Because I don't think you guys are ready for this. Period. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Like one of the cast members is experiencing some technical difficulties in taking life. Get a few drinks, you know, get some malts, maltina, malts preferably. Yeah, sit back and relax and I'll come to you guys when everything's sorted out. So the rules of the game are very simple. I'm going to ask each contestant one question and they have about five seconds to answer the question. If they can't answer the question in five seconds, I would award the points to the next person that can answer the question and the person has to yell Lagos because there's no place, no place like Lagos eh? <laughs> So they have to shout Lagos before they answer the question I hope you guys got that because I don't see it for myself Okay, first question How many, how many biscuits is a Costa biscuit? A. One B. Four Four You don't make to answer out loud Minus one for her, give her minus one <laughs> Why can't you listen to instructions? Give her minus one. Fast. I mean, she didn't even get this. She didn't get this. I know I know the answer. Finish your options. Remember, I'm the one that goes to ask who will answer the question. How many biscuits is a Costa biscuit? A, one. B, four. C, six. D, five. Cynthia. Ah, you continue on who you know will not get the question. Costa biscuits. Costa is the one that is yellow, right? Wait, wait, wait. Yellow? Transparent nylon, blue text. You know they chop Costa? As in biscuit and milk diet. It's either two or four. I don't know. That's wrong, wrong, wrong. See, toasting Lagos. Lagos. Wait, Angie said it. said it first. Angie, that's minus one. I said it first. Angie's not on penalty. No, no. The answer is five. Okay, guys, one point for Angie, zero points for Cynthia. The first time she screamed four. Why did I miss it? Toasting, you're doing a joke. I you said it before she missed the question. Tosin, you did. Which kind of teacher you be? Angie, that is on punishment. Tosin, there's a will sack you from your job. Which Nigerian star has the same O'Shea bodice? A. James Brown. B. Vico. C. Spidelli. <laughs> D. Bob Risky. Or A. Bob Risky. O'Shea. Baddest. 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 That was easy. All of us who eat breakfast now. To be fair, the Costa one was easy as well. Not really. After you missed this, Angie. No mind right now. She don't she don't she don't gain confidence. The Costa one was easy. Easy was easy. Uh, How do Nigerians react to problems? A cry about it. B blame their enemies. C make jokes. D move on. Benson. All of the above. <laughs> that's an option. All of the above. I mean, move on. <laughs> but me, I they do all. Oh, that's even the step. I first cried and I blame my enemies. Wrong. So it's not move on. Lagos, Lagos, Lagos. She not, she not. Blame their enemies. Enemies. But what do Nigerians value more than anything? A. Money. B. Respect. C. Morals. D. Education. Who? Who's the question? Uh, who's the question for? Is it for me? Let me ask you. Okay. Uh, it's money. She know that's wrong. Lagos, Lagos, Lagos. I'm Cynthia, Cynthia. It's respect. 
Eh? It's money now, are you mad? It's not money! If you are the richest in your family, they don't need respect from you. You know why it's not money? Even a broke man in Lagos still wants to tell you who he is. It is money because if you don't have money, you don't have respect. You guys in the audience, what do you guys think the answer is? Do you guys Nigerians value mo uh, money more than respect? Let me know, let me know, let me know. It's also it also depends on what generation of Nigerians. Alright, no be generation. Now now respect. No be generation. The Nigerians that live in Nigeria, they are the same. They're not different. Yeah, but I don't think I don't think our generation demands respect as much as the older generation. Shall. If anything, I'll say morals. Alright, yeah, please, or yeah, please. Morals call. I die. Which morals? Gonna I'll slap you or it's money. Alright, if I cut your beer beer. Nigerians value morals that we value but we don't have it. What do Nigerians believe in more? Tradition, religion, other people's perceptions of them, all of the above. Or all of the above. Correct. I'm too good. I'm too good. <laughs> so I'll kill you. I'm too good. Justin, I didn't get I didn't get that when I answered it correct. What do you mean? I didn't get correct. Like everybody was just fighting me. I beg, after you cheated, you won't correct on top. No mind down. Um, I have haters, but let's write them. No peace. This question goes to Shino. What for what genre of movies do Nigerians love the most? A action. B drama, C comedy, D romance. Romance. Correct. Eh? Did you just say correct? What? Which Nigerian likes romance are they? Tosin, Tosin, come. Tosin, give me that paper. Give me that paper. Give me that paper. Give me that paper. Give me that. Paper. I'll argue this point down. Which stupid romance? Where? It's comedy, obviously. But I know the moderator. I want my points. Ah uh ah. -uh. It's drama. Oh. Sorry, Tosin, how is it romance? How many university movies have they made in Nigeria? If you look about Nollywood, it's love now. Which romance are they? Not, not be juju that they do for Nollywood. Tosin, they like love too much. Okay, but you know what? You know what? It's not too far fetched. It's not too far fetched. 99% of Nollywood films is romance. Cynthia, which Nollywood are you watching? How? If you say Nollywood, then I'll go with romance. If you say TV shows, then I'll go with drama. The genre is vibe, because everything I like are that reloaded or more ghetto. It could be comedy, it could be romance. But the answer is rom com, because that's honestly what they like. It's rom com. It's rom com, but you didn't put rom com there. Me, I give you romance, because that's what you like. Give my points. Thanks. <laughs> Cynthia, your next question. What do Nigerians think they can't do? Again, what do Nigerians think they can't do? A swimming, B debates, C basketball, D nothing. Nothing. Hey, nothing. Correct. <laughs> Nigeria will carry last. Never ever. In all aspects. We they carry second to last sometimes, yeah? But you know you be last. <laughs> Next question goes to Benson. It's a bit of a tough one. What is Owambe? One, a wedding party. B party. C birthday party. D all of the above. All of the above. Correct. You say you say I wear this eyeglass for nothing. Public service announcement. If you're having a wedding in Nigeria, call me. Call the gang. Guys, see I got to like four this December. I'm not you hear me. I'm bad at loading. I go toast the person we catch bouquet. <laughs> Maybe she talks in a sign. Don't invite, don't invite Shino to your wedding, please. Angie, though. Next question, Angie. What was Mr. Big's famous for? A. Fried rice. B. Meat pie. C. Donut. D. Jello. Meat pie. Meat pie. Meat pie. Correct. Uh, ah, where is the sound Lagos? Mr. Big's meat pie was. I swear. Uh, um, uh, after school, we should be day students. Right? Next question is going to Shino. Complete the lyric. Papa just go. I'll come the Abi now. Hey, Abi. Lagos. Abi, why are you fasting now? I go slap you. I... You're not done. You only said one word, bro. <laughs> no, I don't. I thought you said this. Second, please, the lyric. I'll come the now. Aji, please stop hanging on me. It's just a lyric. Anyway, Cynthia, next question. Uh, what was the most painful feeling growing up as a Nigerian child? One, finding out your lesson teacher is coming after they cancelled. B, opening ice cream to find out is a goosey. C, your parents randomly calling you for no reason. D, asking for permission to go out and they ask you if your, your friends have come to their own house. Oh, damn. That lesson teacher one used to do me. But then the going out one too. And even calling me for no reason. Like, bro. It's... That's, that's, that's a very hard one, man. Jesus. Just me, you're cute, Cynthia. I have to step 
it off now. Do you understand my questions have been too good? Guys, no hard. Lucetia is a smart babe now. I so off and not smart now. I'm gonna get a question of I will say calling for no reason. Lagers, hey, lesson teacher, something about lesson teacher. So. Come, is is it not ice cream? Is that a goosey? I'll be I a goosey is ice cream. No! Can't lie, it's lesson teacher, man. But you have to know your parents. Your parents don't they buy ice my parents don't they buy ice cream. So if I see ice cream inside free, now I goosey peanuts. That would have better beef stew. <laughs> Alright, your question. Complete the lyric. Complete the lyrics, I mean the song. This is a super story. Jesus. I know it starts with a life or something. Oh, good. Lagos! Lagos, Lagos! Lagos! I said it first. I'll slap you. I said it first. Are you ready? Okay. <laughs> this is a super story. A life of strife for sorrows. This is super story. Oh, said it starts with a life. Oh, God. Ah, guy, I'm embarrassed, man. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed for you. I don't know they watch AIT, NTA, MITV, all those vibes. So, simply tell us our points now so far so we know who is leading and who is behind. So, leading is um, Angie Cynthia Shino and then Ore and Benson are tied right now Shino, your question Who is most likely to overdress at someone's wedding? A. The mom of the bride B. The mom of the groom C. The exes of the groom D. The exes of the bride You see, personally, at my own wedding me I know that it's my own exes, you get So now the exes of the groom Lagers! Lagers! I will slap you, the exes of the groom Yeah, it's exes I expect my exes to wear white at the wedding, made it soft. Oh my, it's actually of the groom for sure. If I marry my ex, she no not even know the location. It's the mom of the groom, mom of the bride. It's my ex, but mm -mm. why would your ex even attend your wedding? Maybe just wants to be cordial. Somebody like show up with the right person. Uh, uh why not? You guys, let's decide in the comment section because clearly these people are shouting right now. Benson, your question. Please, I'm, I'm, I'm maltreating. How did you used to download music in the old days? A. Spotify. B. YouTube. C. Two exclusive.com. D. None of the above. Two exclusive now. Correct. Two exclusive now. Come. There's, there's another one that is meant to be there. Wap trick. Wap trick supposed to be there too. Do you know that's very true? Wap down. Toxic wap. Not just okay, Niger loaded, MP3 Ninja. Oh, yeah, oh god. Bro, we don't come from trenches. No, you don't have that flow sick low key. Let me give it to you, low key. Take it slow, slow like a mother. Ah! www.2exclusive.com. Not just okay.com. Eh, hey, flow sick. What show started first? A. MTM Project Fame. B. Goda's Ultimate Search C. Martina Dance Hall D. Big Brother Nigeria Project him, project him Wrong, 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 wrong Ah, no, I'm Lagos So see, wait, no, no, to be fair Like, my network is actually bad I'm not joking Ah, uh, really? I beg, see Lamba Hey, like, this is a liar Cause she said project him, yeah, a liar Lagos, Lagos Best is said it first The answer is Big Brother Ninja That's the answer Wrong Lagos, Lagos, Lagos. She does. It's good that ultimate says. Angie. Eh? People are just liars. How is he wrong, guy? Good that ultimate said was from 2000 and something. This is why Nigeria is corrupt. No! That's literally wrong. Big Brother came in like 2004. No, that's Big Brother Africa, not Nigeria. Good that ultimate says I was like eight. Bro, I was watching Good House Mission when I was like four or five. It was Big Brother Africa that we had when we were younger. It was Big Brother Nigeria started recently. Big Brother Africa was when we were younger. So what's the question? Which was her first? You didn't get it. You people see your wuru wuru. You didn't see your wuru wuru for here, Abby. You didn't see. It for it. What was Big Treat known for? One, meat pie. Two, donuts. C, cookies. D, bread. I want to say meat pie, but it might be donuts. Meat pie, meat pie, meat pie, meat pie, meat pie, meat pie. Meat pie. <laughs> Lagos, Lagos. Alright. Bread. 
yeah, it's a question or a timer, remember. What shape did cheese balls change into? A. Cylinder B. Triangle C. Zigzag D. None of the above. Change. Cylinder. Correct. What? Come on, will you shut up? Wait, okay, so which cheese balls is now? It, it was circle, it became cylinder, and then it became spiral, like a C curve. If I come on, yeah, which cheese balls did they chop? You they chop American cheese balls. I said, you they chop cheese puffs. Where? Oh, yeah. <laughs> No be cheese balls with that, not cheese puffs. Oh well, no be cheese balls. Not cheese it. <laughs> you're about to miss you're about to miss me again. Benson, your tone. Which meme was not made in Nigeria? One, there's no place like Lagos. Two, you don't know about it. Three, six thousand years. Four, tiny bro, eh? No, there's no place like Lagos. Final answer. There's no place like Lagos. It wasn't made in Nigeria. Lagos. 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 I had she knows. The answer is you don't know about it. You don't know about it. It, was made... it wasn't made in Nigeria. He's Ghanaian. He's not Nigerian. It was made in Accra. Oh, fast, fast. Oh. Angie. It was made in Accra. Accra. Which one be Accra now? Akara? Ghana, Kumasi, Charlie, your papa. Yeah, I say Charlie, but I say Accra. Pick a strong goose, Accra. Who celebrates Nigerian independence the most? A. Diaspora. Nigerians in the diaspora. B. Nigerians in Nigeria. C. Governments. D. Ambassador. Uh, diaspora now. Us in Nigeria, we no care again. Benson, your question. Where did Lucy originate from? A. Ibu B. Hausa C. Yoruba D. None of the above I say Ibu Correct Who is last? I don't say I don't be last again I don't even be second to last Because they make it the best No! They make everything the best No, it's not the best though When I know they make anything the best though, I die Wait, what do you mean? They you don't taste Bini and Lucy before No triumph <laughs> I know people don't make egusi. I don't know what you mean, no. Do you guys chow egusi with rice? Egusi and rice is sexy. Mmm. You don't chop egusi and jello. Eh? <laughs> it is slop. She know. She know what you say. <laughs> she know what you say. What do you say? What do you say? What do you say? No, that's nah, just idea. Don't be saying I don't say. I don't say make you doable. That's just idea. She know you're a bastard. <laughs> what song broke out first in Back to the World among the options? A. Oliver Twist. B. Ojo Aleba C. Chop My Money D. Johnny Oliver Swiss by the man Correct If you feel that one, I would have, would have revoked your Nigerian car I swear, I, the way I want to shout Lagos Ah, uh, no, nah, are you whining me? Oliver Twist is the reason why Afrobeat is big in the UK That is way good, the way good they dance to Oliver Twist <laughs> You get it, bon, 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 brika, brika. <laughs> So, Cynthia and Angie are Tied. No, 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 bottom, bottom. Sina is in the lead. Alright, alright, it's coming up, coming up. Benson is in the race. Is in the race. Alright, listen, what does the slang tata for mean? A, a soothsayer. B, a wise man. C, a gossip. D, a teacher. Gossip. <laughs> Benson, he pay you. <laughs> Are they pray on your downfall for that question? Oh, God. Ah, uh, is it? Benson, Benson, Benson. What is one toxic trait that majority of Nigerians have? One, they don't mind their business. Two, they care about what other people think. C, they are pride. D, imagine us having any toxic traits. What are your thoughts again? Hey, it's all choco. Benson is acting like he doesn't know the questions though, but he knows this. Minus our points. Minus is interrupting me. This Angie. One, they don't mind their business. Two, they care about what other people think. C, they are pride. D, imagine us having any toxic traits. This one hard over, I'll say. <laughs> they care what small people think. Final answer. Oh yeah, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, that is the wrong answer. Now, I'm going to give it to the contestants. Lagos. Lagos. Lagos! Alright. <laughs> pride. Yeah, correct. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Huh? How? 
Do Nigerians mind their business? First of all, do Nigerians mind their business? Nigerians don't mind their business, so Tosin, how is it pride? Was that a pride or imagine us having any toxic traits because of our pride? Ori and Shino are tied right now. Huh? You are not in the lead. I was sorry to tell you. See, you guys, I feel when you guys noticed that I was winning, that's when you decided to plot against me. Because I was clearly in the lead. She not Benson, haters. I die. Sweetheart, you're not participating. If I conk you, I die. Tiebreaker. The final question. The most important question. Wait, how do we how do we answer this one? I'm going to do three, two, one, and then whoever answers first, answers first. You say Lagos, you don't say answer. How old is Nigeria? A 50. B 62. C 60. D 61. Protectors get ready in three, two, one. Lagos. Alright, said first. What? Yes now. Oh yeah, alright, what is the answer? 61. Alright wins today's challenge. Fuck do you mean? No no no. Fuck do you mean? I actually said it first. I die. It was alright. Yes, it was alright. She know I'm sorry. No P. It was literally like a split second. Like it was like a millisecond. She know wait till Drake talk again. I know you ain't at the top because I'm there. I'm standing there. That's how I know you ain't there. Alright, I can swear for you. What does being Nigerian mean to you? I beg, should we talk honestly or should we whine Nigeria? I beg, let the winner talk. Okay, she don't, it's okay. <laughs> he paid them. Why would I be salty when I said he face? You get sauce fast, McDonald's fries, fool. Be Nigerian. First of all, Nigeria, hey God. <laughs> God help us. In fact, God supposed not tired to help us. No, I said, what does being Nigerian mean to you? I didn't say being in Nigeria. Let me let me just calm down. Being Nigerian means everything to me, man. That's my identity, that's my culture. I love being Nigerian because Nigeria feels like home. It's the banter for me, it's our outfits for me. I don't know if you know any Nigerian that isn't hilarious. It's the resilience, it's the people, it's the chaos culture is amazing our people are amazing our vibes are amazing no matter where you are you always rep your country I'm diverse and we have so much to contribute the people are crazy there is not a day when you're in nigeria there's no form of drama the people are resilient as hell now we they run things at the end of the day all speak the same language even though all of us have different languages like internally like all of us speak the same language like i don't know if you know what i mean no matter how hard the government and like the the economy is working hard to make us sad and whatever like our people are resilient we make jokes we carry on and we push through being nigerian epitomizes the black experience to a t so i hope you guys like this video make sure to share tell a friend this was actually quite hilarious and i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'm gonna ask you the question and what does being nigerian mean to you I would love to hear your answers. So leave that in the comment section below. And I'm going to be signing out. Wait, wait, before I get to that, I hope you guys have actually subscribed because ah, give this a like. Let's get this video to Nigeria 61. Let's give this video to 5,000 likes. Make sure to get this video to 5,000 likes if you really enjoyed it. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. And don't forget that I'm going to be doing my police education shout out. So if you guys want to shout out in my next video or episode of At Your Big Age, make sure to hashtag BDT, hashtag baby girl too. So I'm going to be signing out by saying go crazy, go stupid, and I'll see you guys back again in some new BDT content. That's the one. Nigeria, hey, God. Hey, 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 God emotes. In fact, God's supposed to be tired to emotes. Let's be done to the side. Our president, if we get, I don't know. If we get, maybe, I don't know. I don't know. know. <laughs> president may be close. Hey, I went yeah. to go and eat. I was no, eating, I was when, drinking. When Orel won, when Orel won, he said, fuck it, 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 we have to knock you. You know that we're sure guys, guys, there's nothing that Angie has not been. Angie has been <laughs> Nepal, Blame, <laughs> Network, <laughs> Swift, Spectra, Dead. You may have seen that Network. <laughs> <laughs>
Actually, I got a good excuse for everything. I know you want me. Every day, not only when you're lonely. Yeah, you see, you think you know me. But you don't even know nothing about me. Yeah, it's in my thick.